the Dragonite. High armor, they don't have that much burst damage inside yeah. of VP, pretty static damage besides Omni Slash, high spin. The no the core is even going to the mid lane, it's not going to the top lane for him. But Rams was always one of those heroes. Oh, he's dead. Oh, yeah, yeah. with a stun. I was, gonna, I was gonna say he's one of those players that always pushes the extreme because he's playing something like Live Stealer, the very yeah. hard to kill style heroes, but this Juggernaut. That's uh, a little too easy. I, I won't say that's a good death, Toby, but it's it's questionable because I think there's a lot of carry players that might, you know. Bottom lane. Whoa. Then jumping in with the Io. The tether's already in there from F line. That's going to make it so Army is very strong getting back up to the tower. Rod just got a homing missile on him, too. They push the issue way too hard. Even Dark's here. Yep. Stunned it, up for a little bit. You, know what, Ed, you get four spells for your death. If he runs back to base or dies to neutrals or something, I feel like that's less oh, effective. This is this is so smart. I think the die will get the kill. Because if you try and go late game against the massive burst potential of a squad like you, Lion Initiation, a puck in Tiny, like so much magical burst damage, and then they'll always have the Gyrocopter to rely upon to just spew oh, out bomber. damage. Up on top, Lion's in a lot of trouble. They already did the deep war. That's why Lion was itching his way in. Puck will Dream yep. Call him, um, Dream Call, Illusionary Orb his way to safety. My brain's still waking up. Yep. Uh, and you've got that level one in the phase shift. Yep. Because I suppose dual breath, like dual breath, doesn't have like this double, double kind of breathe over the mm. top, so it's very difficult for Puck to dodge. Yeah, Rod I... just still wants to go in, and now, oh, silence already out, but the spin stance off. There goes your illusionary orb into the trees, but that's why you hold the rolling baller from Roger. Even gets the kick into X oh, over. No. EP supports coming in. It's Fy. He'll tether up towards Charles, trying to keep the puck alive. But now you've actually got Fy in too deep. It's LGD's turn to over or underestimate. That defensive lane. Sorry, Xno, I'm for that drums build. And as soon as you have drums level six on a gyro, you're so strong. And look at this. A They're rocket baiting. on the darks here. They're baiting in mid. But Down on bottom, like uh, bottom lane can have his fight as well, but the big kill will be if they can actually get this one onto the onto the tiny. But now TP support comes in from FY, so Pasha does die on the bottom. There's that gyro problem you're talking about. Ice path splits the field. It's not stopping Tiny from pushing it any further, but he'll just toss back the Dragonite into the three hero attack with the brief fire. Uh, not enough damage reduction. No one will still end up falling. But with the yep. ice path and the kick from Roger, revenge will be onto the lion. Oh. Gotta give him, a, give him a tether, maybe. There's the tether away. Perfect timing, actually. Yeah, he took his time. I was like, <laughs> lane dominates once you give him an advantage. But Charles is actually winning this lane. 27-13 versus 32-7. I guess I'll call that even, but bear in mind, this is the awful. Oh, here they go again. FY. Oh, that's going to be problematic for him. Yep. Picked off once again. He would, so Ramsey is very much aware that maybe is nearby. Bottom Meanwhile, on bottom lane, attack. trouble for the Darkseer, running away, but he cannot do so. The homing missile would have chased him, even yeah. if Ame's attack didn't connect. Yeah, now, yep. if they have relocate available for that coil, that fight is going so much worse for the and side BP of Ernest Bro. feel the blood. They know there's no big call down available, so they come in with four heroes. They're using the iron shell damage to burn down X Nova. They want more of a kill, so they move forward, focus on the iron. No one's doing the job with the stuns, but they still need to get further in. Tiny's making it difficult. This avalanche is just a multi stun in. Now Ramses will finally join the fight. He'll spin and look for the Face kill it. onto FY. Movement speed, FY cannot get away. The breathe fire and Dragon Sun, no one's still not certain he wants to be involved in this fight. It's gone so long, you've almost got Dream Call back off corner. Wow. Oh, what a great toss. It's a burst combination working with the warning grip, but now rolling ball to two, combining with the Omni Slash. Gyrocopter is low and brought down. Even a finger out, but the Dragon Tail's done. They need to turn their attention over towards the puck. He's such a huge kill and Ramses will claim him. This is just a never-ending bloodbath and they're not done yet. Dive underneath the tower. DK may feel confident enough to do so, but P here comes LGD. TP back over. They got the Dragon Tail stun, but FY is the one who came in. They want the kill on onto the Tiny, but with FY here, he's relocating them away. The stun from the Ice Path. FY can't finish the channel. They'll end up getting the kill over on FY. No one's free fire actually ticks him out, and now they go in again onto maybe, hiding in the trees. Roger's nearby while Lion goes further to the east. The Breathe Fire from no one will get that one too, and Tiny rolling ball forward, chucking on into the spin. He knew the Avalanche was coming. He'll take the Creep Wave and the kill. And we kill someone, as you said. Mm -hmm. Th they run out of spells and thus damage. BP, oh. such low cooldowns. 
Well, the coach has been caught out. He's a stand-in for Solo, who's feeling sick, but Jakira can't get himself away from this one. TP scrolls on cooldown. He came in to do an Observer Ward mission, and they're actually pinging. The funny thing is, by anyway. why is he even giving him a clap? Yeah, so this is the Ward God. I, I love this decision from no one. He has 2k HP. He doesn't... You just go Radiance. You have slight damage issues as this game scales, but that mischance on a Gyro is not negligible. Oh. Top lane, you'll see the end of the Chakira. Meanwhile, mid lane's being pushed in. It's a Dark Seer, uh, shelled up Creep, the Sentinel, who's able to get the stun out. He'll actually grab an Invis rune and now do this run. And uh, thanks to the Invis rune, they get the information on the Io and the Gyrocopter. They're sending the Dark Seer, surged in unit. They're looking for the stun, and the Creeps are coming out. There's a problem for the Gyrocopter. He's taking way too much damage. But then again, the hexed up uh, Dark Seer, he can still run forward, find the Iron Shell burst damage. Same for the Lion. They just return so much when Tiny arrives. Ramsey will be able to get the kill on FY, but does he get out this one scot free? Starts his spin, does not actually use the TP. He's holding it. He's got no other teammates here, but he's got only slash of verbal. He'll jump over to the creep camp on the side. It, yes. He doesn't do the damage. Okay. Still, but wait, he did not actually get rid yep. of this regeneration. And this is Dark Seer Jakiro in the pit, Toby. Yep. How do you initiate? VP, come to us. Oh, here they come. We're ready. Gyrocopter, the call down's down. Same with the dream call. They don't want to be The spins out. Jakiro just go down. They're fighting inside the macro pile, however. Remember, Roshan is the primary target. 600 HP. A man is stunned. Burner's pro. They just got wrecked. They still want to try and fight it out, however. ES goes in. Roger, they actually he got the kill and the Aegis of the Immortal on Roshan, so it's it, it, it's it's something. But they didn't kill anyone from LGD. Dude, that was perfectly played from the side of LGD. I didn't re I didn't click on Gyro. He has a Black King bar. He just runs in. You can't actually target him. He drops all. Okay, so it's hard to get the instant jump. But that's why you have the tiny observer wards down. They'll see Ramsey's move forward, but they don't know. They're doing it, they're is doing Rogers it. nearby? So they go for the jump. Oh, in. The spin, X Nova. He started to go for the finger of death, but he did not get it off in time. Ramsey's will heal up. X Nova will go down, and that was a sp during his Omni Slash phase. But it's like if, he, if he moves out of it, does he get stuck? Yeah. And then she pulls him out yeah. of his Omni Slash. Well, what, I don't think it would pull him out of his Omni Slash, but maybe afterwards. I don't know. We'll ask Fog about it. Relocates coming in. They just a quick kill on Roger. He was trying to do the side lane push now. VP want to try and do something on this. Shakira, a little bit too far up. Can't get the ice path down. Knows the relocate's coming in, so the ice path is already down. It doesn't have over, over on the iron, and Juggernaut will be slashed. He doesn't actually kill off FY! 7 HP! FY is able to survive. Double buyback coming in for Virtus Pro. They really want to find this kill. Lion's gone off to the east. That's the easier one to go for, and that's the one they'll take. But again, double buybacks. You still get the kills. You... He had at least six. A lightning bounce. Something like that would have killed him. Yeah. Virtus Pro, they're trying to make the most of the situation. They're running into towards the mid. What? ES, he's baiting. Tiny comes out. ES, well, this bait, one charges will come out. But then again, Roger's already dead. 71 seconds down. You'll get the Dagon kill. Jakira is down for pretty much the same amount of time. And... It, it feels like they just don't have the heroes or the items that are able to contest. Gyrocopter is a butterfly, and he's more than halfway to a satanic already. They're going in. It's going to point out the fact that Juggernaut, Omni Slash is on cooldown for 10 seconds time. He bought Blink Dagger, so there's no buyback available. No one's doing the best he can with the Dark Seer Wall combination to just push back the Gyrocopter with a breathe fire. The damage output of the Gyrocopter is nowhere near as much as he would really like it to be. So this take what Ame comes to give you. And I don't know if any of these heroes can He's just going to mantra an Omni. Like, that's got to that's gotta be what happens. Ramses jumps up. He is instantly silenced. Does not want to go for the Omni Slash. But that's why you get the Dragon Tail stun out. Over on the puck. Pasha coming in. A great ice puck. They have to keep the puck control and bring him down. Able to do so. A minute on cooldown. No one. Now caught on the wrong side of the tracks. You've got maybe in there. Avalanche will create so much time with the toss up. And DK does go down. The finger of Death gave just enough damage to do so. Io popped up in the back lines by Ramses. But by back and relocate forward, he'll be there to support the rest of his team. Poor coach, by coach. And the LGD will push high ground. The game you could possibly get away with it, but I, I don't think play. so. I don't, I don't, uh, it's like 10 well, percent time. Dream call over on the Dragonite. They want to save him. Darcy has got both Pipe and Crimson Guard to protect the Dragonite. Not to mention, his surged up Centaur looking for the sun, combining with the Ice Path. They've got Lion in the back lines so they can just remove this control factor. Yeah.
While the rest of LGD are together, DK wants no more. Blinks on cooldown. They're running forward. Look for that Earth Spirit. Does he have a rock? Does he have a kick? He's not going to use it. They look towards Roshan instead, but still on the timer. One minute until he will spawn. But Dragon Knight, blink forward. He's going for FY. They want to get this kill on the Aya. Remove the support. On the side as well. FY, the Ghost is protecting him. They all will bounce back out and will be brought down. He'll get the mech off and the heal. No one took cop so much damage. He wants to get out of the cooldown. Able to do so with the breathe fire. They're actually living. The healing one. You said Puck will finally kill it off, but the Gyrocopter is BKB. Now he'll burn it with the Satanic. So much sustain, so much life. The Tiny, however, he's also stunned up. The DK showing his own sustain back under the shrine to where LGD feel like they're meant to be safer, but they can't do it. Puck rolling boulder. They wow. found him in the tree. Wow. Murder's Pro. What? With the Crimson Guard, it got completed just before the yep. fight began. So you got damage reduction on multiple fronts. And the healing war that you mentioned as well in the fight, they never reached it. No one wants to be aggressive. They're taking the bottom melee ranks. The mid tower has been taken by creeps at the same time. And three heroes down. How much damage? Make him run away. Make him chase you. Look at Jari's answer. They want the Aegis Immortal, uh, but he's got a rapier in the quick yeah, buy. That they, they're having damage problems. Oh, that's an answer. Over. Tiny. He saw the DK. Dragon form comes up pretty quickly. They need some extra control. Earth Spirit is trying oh to provide But DK just focus. And the drink call. They committed to actually kill off Earth Spirit. So Roger will go down. He doesn't have buyback. DK does. For uh, LGD. They, you get a Rax first. You can have plenty of time. Maybe even two racks if you is, is, find time for top. You've got to get through Macro Pyre. Like, it's such a great deep push. This creep wave, at least it's got catapults in it, so it'll survive to get up, but then Ice Pump, that's an interesting one, won't stun anybody. Buyback does come in from the DK, no he wants to breathe fire the Gyrocopter, but they already proved that they can burn through his life. So Rax for Rax will end up being this trade-off, unless they can keep that melee up. Gyrocopter, nah, he's got a, a denial that was attempted by now, Randy, this is but cool, won't happen. Orb to back away, and Virtus Pro, where do you want to find? Looks Tiny's blocking from the tree line, Roshan, he's almost dead, he's down to one third of his life, Lion moves forward under the cover of Glimmer Cape, so any initiation would have been pretty naught, and they will actually claim it, Roshan is already dead, they did it so quickly, without committing an IO, he left, I mean Gyrocopter, there's the attack, he'll come out, the only side of the damage is high, one kill over on the Lion, FY, he's so low, Randy's will find him as well, I can't believe how much damage what is Pro actually doing? I was once that Dream Core came out, the LGD would have no other power, but Jara still stands his ground, working with the Tiny, and this is now the sustained damage that they have available. Darkseer cancelling his TP, they turned out to break the Aegis Immortal. Jara comes up, he's got Satanic, he ain't in trouble. Maybe they actually go over the top, that's jumping maybe on. Dead. He's having his own battle in the back lines. Randy is able to get the kill onto maybe, and Jara comes up isolated. The Aegis will pop, and they go for another target. It's the Lion! I think he actually bought back to be involved in this fight. They don't see him thanks to the Glimmer Cave, but now they go for the real target. The Gyrocopter is a 5 on 1 beat down. This is real tag team without Tuscar. Virtus Pro, they get another buyback now out the jump. Getting distracted by no one. He kills Pasha, but then he's back. Ramses, in the meantime, is killing everybody with the assistance of Roger. You've killed another tier 3. Charles. The Aegis is gone. He's dodged out, able to get a dream call over on three. They'll be held there, but there's no yeah. call down. There's no flat cannon. Doesn't there's know. no aggression. The timing is not right. So BKB out from Gyrocopter. He'll burn it again, but this will give VP, this will give yeah. VP more confidence in Remember, pushing. Blink Omni slash in 20 seconds. DK form in 20 seconds. VP, yeah. they're not even ready to really fight this, but they're still willing to pressure. But you've got to be careful on the side of LGD. If your gyro dies, this is GG. They fortified a little bit early, so the creep wave actually got mopped up by some of the abilities of Virtus Pro, but they Albert. keep the racks alive. That blink you said, three seconds, two seconds, one second, and watch the ire. You know that's the target to come in from Ramses. If they can get some information, Sentry Wards are kind of currently covering it up, but they see where the IO tether is, but they're all grouped up together. Call down, but it's a great ice path. Gyro and IO caught together. Virtus Pro Call still don't wasted. feel the confidence to go up. The BKB's on cooldown of Gyro for 24 more seconds, but they're returning. It's like you are, uh, you're, you're, you're starting to go wild, Kyle. Hey, man. Maybe uh, that, that, I, I'd be that, a better test. That'll him. happen when players. Oh, Randy's. He's he got just a double damage. Hit. Yeah, he's got a double damage, and they push the Kree wave in through bottom. LGD is not better defense. They just took a free. It's very formidable. You do not <laughs> kill it very easily, and that means you get that aura, and it just negates that 5,000 plus gold that may be spent on his own. Raw Pia. Yeah. And Virtus Pro will watch their damage output. How quick can they get it? 
Refresher shard orbs. Here comes the illusionary. He'll scout it out. The uh, healing ward is inside the pit. But Virtus Pro don't want to be caught here. Tiny gets the avalanche toss off, but only on the dark tier. Where's the wall? Now the only side. FY really vulnerable. The gyro. He actually goes down. Gyro comes across his teammate. And Ramsey wants to go for more. DK stunned up for the moment, but they move down. They want the gyrocopter. They need to remove this rapier. But Tani, can he create some space? He stops to and actually pick up a tree. And in that time, stunned up, brought down. Oh boy, LG I mean, no longer has the confidence to oh. stand and fight. They're chasing X Nova. He's trying to use the Glimmer Cape. TP, the rolling boulder. It's a little bit too far away, but nice Darkseer back. has the back. They will kill off Lion. He'll actually have a moment. He'll be at a Glimmer Cape up for a second, and they've already burned the dust from Roger trying to find him, but they knew where he was. Well, yeah. You can just feel around in the BKB for Gyrocopters. You're happy with that. You have double Halberd now as well. How will Gyro do DPS? There goes the fortification. Dream Call. It's nice. It actually snapped. They jump in. They'll break the Aegis. Immortal plus the big spam out with the avalanche. They'll find the extra kill as well keys. onto the dragon, and he'll get it off. He just turned back into the night. Who's actually able to eg and then the omni side, the toss down, but it brings and Y and Army closer together. They can tank through the omni side. Jara comes to satanic the regeneration. It's high with the black cannon. It's doing so much work. BP will take a lot of hits, but the rapier it drops down. Where is it? Who's got, got it? it? Ramsey's got it. Are you kidding me? He had that immediately. <laughs> he's away too. But they relocate up. They look for him. But Ramsey's, he's in the trees. He actually TP'd out. They didn't find him. He'll get away with rapier. Oh, maybe they were thinking, like, true. maybe they well, catch look, someone look else. Look at what's queued up, though, from the gyro. I it's, mean, this is what you've got to do. It's another one. Mm -hmm. It's just straight rapier but, back in again. Creation in this game. Really? Yeah, just because it's more single target lockdown, if you just CC Ahmed... But now they go on him, maybe he doesn't... Oh, they toss out! They toss him in, the Dragonite, and with the rapier, the damage is so high, the DK is down in seconds, he can buy back into this fight, the Tiny, he's been brought down by the Magnetize for the Gyrocopter, there's, there's that fight they wanted, under vision, with the Gyrocopter, tended up by back. FY, but where is his damage? The Ice Mask Control is so good, the, the Gyrocopter, they actually disarm it, so we can't attack back over, and now the Omni Slash, a triple kill, the second rapier down, and that should be the game. An ultra kill in for Ramsey's. They can finish the job with X Nova in the trees. But FY calls. Good game. Well played. Virtus Pro. What a game. 52 minutes. It's by both sides. Both teams made amazing decisions. Amazing plays. But Virtus Pro. <laughs>Will say yesterday there was a point. I know it was a very different situation, but because you said that Tinker could be something that's somewhat greedy, it's a good response though. Kill the throne. I think that's a good way to play Dota. Mm -hmm. Bottom lane, there, my chalice. With oh, nice, nice toss. Tiny grabbing X Nova underneath the tower. They're TPing in a little bit of extra health. The stomp comes out, but it's Lich. He can just put the frost shield onto the PA, making sure there's no way for X Nova to nice. walk out. And they really, really worth expending that many resources. You need your ET to keep Ame in this game. And I wouldn't be surprised to see Ramsey's go for a similar build to his jug in the last game. Stay active. I don't think he'll be rushing Battle Fury. Maybe a Vlad's, maybe a Yasha, rush Beto, who knows? But whoa. He's out. They're really battling over these five minute runes. They'll pick up the Lich and drag him back. Stick charges will not keep him alive. Yeah, I love that change. It's just such a huge improvement for the quality of life of Doom. Now that you can choose whether or not you want to take the creeps abilities. That was so annoying to play around with. Oh, Tiny's in trouble. Tinker wants to help out. He's gone for a 3-2 build up and OD imprisonment. He's gonna keep the Tiny there for the moment. Here comes your Rockets Ford once again. The uh, one charges, or stick charges I should say. Not enough to keep the Tiny alive. I he didn't go for a toss in the Elder Titan there. I don't know if it would have found a kill, but at least had extra survivability. How spell such a dick thing against a PA? <laughs> like you never want a siphoning dagger onto the anti-mage. Ramsey's begins his TP, no mana void to cancel it. As uh, he is down the bottom lane, muted up. It's gonna be the Centaur War Runner. Doom hit six and um, all that regenerate. Free to do that because he's looking to rotate lanes anyway. So I expect him to just run all the way back up top and off Ooh. top. Ooh, X Nova and FY. They're gonna put the frost shield on Ramsey, send him in, pick him up and throw him down. But then it's just a toss of the Doom in wow. and a double war stomp. It's your own personal ravage. But now Stan, Stampede, Centaur changing up the position. This fight. OG is to build up intelligence for the Eclipse. Only kills off the 
the Lich Mob, Pasha and Roger just working so damn well. X Nova wants to be involved. He'll put the spirit down for the top, only catches out the Tiny, while Pasha, another Infernal Blade. He's got another War Stop available. Tiny will just toss him up, but Rubik, there's your rotation over. Roger in the lane will not be able to escape this. X Nova's even got the plus 60 damage in Avalanche. Okay, the He's second here. you say you will not do something, you'll do it. Tossing it back over. X Nova on so much life, that's so little life that no one can just laser and rocket him down. And you've got another combination. Toss him in. Yep. Toss you know him it's in. coming. One second. Oh, no. Like a dwarf. The war <laughs> stop is down. And the centaur with the Infernal Blade. He's burning to death. He's looking for some damage back into the tank. But now PA comes over. Nice. And White dies. He was looking for a denial onto the centaur. It's a tough it's a tough game though. At the same time, AM Centaur still do hold the top two spots on the leaderboard. All six cores very close together. They're going again on bottom. You know Rams is just going to strike in. Uh, or time for a toss. Roger waiting for it. The avalanche into Chalice, but FY is nearby. They'll just toss Chalice away. But it's really LGD that won a fight. X Nova. Oh, He's gonna put the spirit underneath the tower into the stomp, only catching out the lich while Roger is caught on the wrong side of the tracks. Arme, even he will join this fight. Four heroes from LGD on bot lane. A stampede forward. They want more. They want Ramsey. Where's the support to come in? It needs to come faster. But there's so many heroes. Charles will die. Phantom Assassin has nothing to Phantom Strike over to. All five heroes from LGD. I feel like we're watching Korean Dota. Damage day gone. Nothing like that. Uh, you get, you get probably blink anchor into that. Choice. We'll see. Oh, again, they just fight. FY. Well, they are still tossed the tiny in. He's looking for the Doom and he got it onto the OD. The ET stop won't do enough. No one in range to deny up OD either. And my fear for the side of VP is how do you actually deal with Chalice? He's going to finish a hood soon. And he's nigh indestructible at the moment and does so much damage to these very squishy supports on the side of VP. Speaking of that, goodbye, ET. Jump in from Ramses. Working with no one for the burst damage now. You see Any Mage getting a little bit more aggressive against the Lich. He's going to Sinister Gaze, try and bring him back in. Oh, and with the him. toss, they got another War Stomp. The stun from Pasha. Oh no! Jump. No, no, no. Infernal Blade. How, how did he get caught though? Uh, was... He was he was being, he's farming the Ancients of Virtus Pro. He tried to hide in the tree line, didn't just wrong time. But he thought it was the right time. They had the Observer Ward. They thought. Yeah, he's surrounded by Observer Wards. There's yeah. no way he didn't see that coming. Uh, Lich. Ah, oh, Frost Armor versus oh, nice uh, Frost FY. Armor. Oh, shield. And then support. Over from no one. The laser, rearm into a rocket. Sinister Gaze pulls him in. FY would have died anyway. Oh, what's the kill? Are you, are you having issues with Dota 2? Not a lot of have issues, but we've had this discussion, I mean, Kyle. Dude, what, last patch, I said the same. Anytime Ice Frog just decides to give a hero an extra ability, it just seems to return to the meta. Lich, yeah, sure, you replaced one, but you, instead of killing his own allies, you now gave him a stun that drags you closer. I mean, come on. Yeah. Why pick Pudge when you can just hypnotize him? Oh, oh, Stampede, they're coming in, looking for no one. The Stampede actually allows them to get a lot closer with the Imprisonment. Now the ET follow into a spirit stomp. This Tinker really being controlled in the back lines. Charles wants to come in to finish the job, oh, but then nice. Sinister Gaze cancels the attack. The Lich only will bounce on towards the X Nova. No one still wants to get away from here, but FY is dying too. They've lost their control. They're looking for X Nova in the tree lines, but where are they going to find him? No one's right next to him. The spirit's out. The stomp, it won't connect on no one, but they've already found the target. No one's sticking around with the toss. Actually, yeah, just throw me yeah. on top. Ramsey's. You like, can't. You, they, you can get away from the fights. Like, yeah. They, may, maybe that's the best way to look at it. Where LG will always be able to fight on their terms. Maybe not like when this happens. TV out won't work, and you can take a bite at FY. Uh, but you got Stampede. You got ET Stomp. You've got Split of Chant. The Observer Ward sees Centaur and OD moving. So Pasha, he'll move in, and they reveal the Shadow Blade. Sentry was down, he'll still get the Doom over on the oh, Centaur Wall Runner. Maybe not the exact target they wanted, but when they get the double avalanche, by triple avalanche with FY's arrival, they get the opening. The Lich Chain Frost bouncing around, it will now stop the Centaur. He's the one they're focusing to kill off the toss of PA. He couldn't reach over towards the OD in the mid lane. Stampede is out, Wall Stomp and Stick Charges. This Centaur has tanked through so much before Ramsey's finally cuts off the hoofs. Avalanche is good from Tiny. Toss is available. Send him up combined with a stifling dagger. Another fake ball. He actually fight. got the imprisonment into himself. Combining with the easy splitter. Then blinks away and they slap down Ramsey's X Nova's the one to find the kill with mover speed. But no, you've got no one's range. The rockets do the work. Okay, you probably kill him, but 
before the Doom ends, yeah. instead of after. He just didn't have the option. They had the Observer one, so the information was there. Roger's in trouble. The stolen Avalanche being used against the original owner. And it will be Ame who does... Now, like, understand all these heroes doubling down on that investment, because you can't kill towers at either side. The blink forward. Tinker's gonna get the laser off. The Doom, however, they actually caught the OD in the back line for the ET split to kill off no one. X Nova, no, no one! He can walk away! X Nova didn't have the damage, but OD's base attack! No orbs available and still finds the kill. Pasha wants to finish the job, so they put on the frost shield and they go into the trees. OD needs to die. Core for core trade off, and then pulling in the anti mage as soon as the gate and the follow up done from Pasha and Randy's. No! no the crit. blink is so no range and he doesn't get hit by the tree! It was Pasha's hunting for another kill. He wants someone to walk up the hill into the fog of war. Lich moves up at the same time. They're gonna find the Rubik. Already got the frost shield off. That wasn't intended for the centaur. But with Infernal Blade, PA moving over. They turn their attention into the lane where Tiny, as well as Tinker, have already done their work. Chain Frost, it has one crit to balance to, but then it goes down to the Ancients. Not where it wanted to be, but Ramsey's did the RNG. You can fight this. PA, BKB, and the spam march. This is impossible to fight into. You're asking they're, to get wrecked. They're there like they want to fight. Now Tinker's out of mana. He jumped back as wow. And Tiny goes in, he gets a double avalanche off the imprisonments in the air because that's just how things work. F5 will hit the ground with the stop. Chalice jumps in, the stampede, but I see Eclipse in the back line. Chain Frost will do some roll, a level of chain damage back, but not really enough. But it's the uncontrollable Phantom Assassin looking for crits, but not having enough teammates to stay on the front lines. Even with the buyback from Doombringer, they did spells from the PA, the Lich, you know, no stuns because we can also expect, uh, you see, it's already queued up. No one will be going to the hex. Pasha finds the OD, gets the Doom off. Tinker, he's gonna come over as well and needs to give a little bit of extra damage, but they can't reach him. Sentries are down. Observers as well, but OD's back underneath the tier Here 2 tower. Pasha's looking for more information, and Ramsey's is gonna work with him. The ET Spirit's following him in. Rubik just critted down. They still want OD, but he can. On Ramsey's just drastically increases his damage <laughs> output. You so retro, Mr. Haunt. <laughs> using Warcraft names, Chalice, nice hook stomp, into the follow-up stomp, that comes in from the ET and Splitter, PA, thanks to the Frost Shield, doesn't take anywhere near as much damage as they want, but Doom, he'll fly in, gets the follow-up stomp, oh, Centaur goes double. down without getting his ulti off, and that point's in way too deep, you've got the blink away from Arme up the trees, and into the high ground, He's gonna go. but now what? they go in, straight after him, and pop him, and kill him, what LCD! Was that? Uh, I saw, like, I've seen it come from me to have even a prayer of surviving. And now they've got no buybacks available. You went for the Shiva's guard over on the OD. He doesn't have the money to buy back into the game. He's short by about a hundred. So Ramses can force the issue a little bit harder. This is when the Desolator actually helps you to beep through the towers with negative seven armor. They can be so much faster at this. And Tiny, oh yeah, we forgot about him. Hold on a tree and buildings just shatter because rocks aren't as strong as trees. This is logic. Mid melee Rax is gone and Virtus Pro, they can back out. Never. Unless someone wants to present themselves for a fight. Doom is off court in 18 seconds, so Pasha, he's if looking for here. it. Spell blocks up, Roger jumps in, they're looking for the kill, another spell block, and they cannot keep the fight going, but you can just toss him the Centaur, Sinister Gaze, hold him, and wow. kill him. Stampede gone, and they can keep this fight going. If you get another pick off, it's still 5v4. OD will respawn, the backdoor regen is the only thing making it difficult. And Ramsey's is shopping in the meantime. <laughs> Multitask, he's casually juking the stop. Oh wow, he couldn't even get the stun out. Oh. Any mage blinks away to safety, away from the tiny avalanche, but now PA with the cleave, he's into the back triple line. Daggers, Ramsey daggers. just wants to go into a boss mode, triple daggers indeed. He looked for his target over towards the enemy mage, but OD, that's one way, send him to another realm, but now he's back up, the dagger kill onto FY. Total control, and Verdant Pro, it's template aggression with no real weakness. I don't I don't know what they're looking to do there. You're astraling and trying to initiate on a PA that has blacking bar ready, and ages. How is that ever going to work? You've just taken a fight that almost guarantees you're going to lose that second Rax. And yet, Ramsey's is. He's, has he been stomped in this game since that engagement? 100% cleave damage, Toby.
when you think about it, it there's not that much armor on the LGD heroes. You've no. got nine on Centaur, Rubik's got six, and ET's got four. The OD, as well as the Amage, you control them with Asher Abyssal. Oh. Now they find their better target, Stampede, trying to spice a little bit of space. It's FY. Ashley gets the pickup and throw down. Roger's in very deep, and FY, he'll toss back the Lich and get the kill with this. Then the follow up <laughs> stomp into the Lich. This is a great combination from LGD. Never beneath the Sentry Ward's Doombringer's gotta be careful. Chalice can see him for the moment, now he doesn't. Shadow Blade will wear off, but look at him come. He actually got the blind hoof stomp over on the Doombringer, but uh, it's the top lane, and he made. Did he not realize uh, there were still friends around? Now the Doom is off on the Elder Titan. Remove him. Whoa! Ramses! Oh! Delete, 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 control, alt, delete, LTD for a reset of this. A great hoof stomp will buy some time in the oh, OD. Oh, oh. We'll get revenge. Two heroes down. Charles is the last one surviving from LGD. There's still a heavy amount of damage done by killing off those two cores. And we'll see just how tanky Charles can be. The Frost Shield is out. This will slow him up. Another hoof stomp. He just needs some time, but the Frost Shield hits him as well as the Avalanche. He can't get his blink off call down and yeah, Why even feared back at the last Why moment. You can see how much damage it takes from an OD. I am very uncertain about what actually the Centaur did. Just to point this out, he bought his Aghanim Scepter, so he doesn't have buyback available. That's interesting. When they're facing being potentially Megan and Tinker blinks away, you cannot control him with the stomp. It's a double kill for no one. X nova has gone. The OD as buyback does not want to use it, but without the ET, like, again, so much pressure on this anti-mage to keep the control, so there's only two buybacks, one on the OD, one on the Centaur, they have to make this work. So smoke up, Pasha, the one to be presented, burn off the mana, find the kill, even the Eclipse, they threw the kitchen sink at that Doombringer! Look at the Courier as well, they're just, every 10 to 15 seconds they micro it into the pit to see if it's spawned, and they will know that this is active, They see it they now. will need to engage around it. But but actually, well they, well they don't see the glove, <laughs> it's, just on the, it's just on the edge. They're looking for an opportunity. There's an Invis rune on the Rubik. And he's got Blink Dagger with a jump. Uh, it goes the other way. Centaur can't get the stampede off. He he looked like he are was they not playing ready? The, I think they were playing the bait game, but you're right. It's, it's like AM's it's not even there. It's bait, but it, it fell off the hook. And now they get a target over towards FY. No one chasing after him. That's why Centaur buy back and stampede. Look for a different target. In towards the mid lane. Tiny on the run. The OD as well as the AM combined <laughs> together. So you the LGD not claiming anything apart from just farming up a couple of neutrals. It's yeah. It's not what they want. In fact, VP now look to go into Roshan as Doom is alive. Oh. And the jump up, the pick, they need Tiny. Does he actually get picked up and pulled up the cliff? Yes, they do with the Bissell Blade control. Tiny will go down. Yeah. That's yeah. the buyback for him. The ET split is quite nice, but Ramsey's in the middle of the fight. OD has to imprison, but it's actually even more problematic. OD will die. Doom up. He tried to actually protect the Centaur, <laughs> but Ramsey's bullsh. Yeah, trip. All those things. Yeah, they do. Now they're getting more damage. Dagon builds in for. Tinker. Oh, that's so cool. He went 25% blur evasion oh, instead boy. of 5% oh, boy. Um, nice. um, issue. An evasion against two cores on the enemy side that not only don't have MKB, but they hate buying it. Yep. And you're seeing Animage already put it into his quick buy. Yep. He, you knows, have to now. he knows he needs it, but this is too late. You can't itemize, itemize against this. Now you're gonna wrap around behind. Animage wants to find the back lines. He wants to find that Tinker who did use buyback to enable this push, and this creates mega creeps. They'll look for him, so it's three seconds until the day. A spell block up, any mage, do not stick around. They're coming in, another spell block. TP's from Centaur, he's coming over towards the Triumphus on bottom lane, where they get the Avalanche out. BKB, in from the RD, looking for another target. Ramsey's slept up, so they try and turn over towards Roger. Burned out of mana, so this tiny won't be a factor if I have to be killed off by the AM in just a second. While the imprisonment, Centaur stomp, it keeps the Centaur control. Ramsey's, he'll come free of it, now looks for his own target. Any mage, the stun, by some time, to this again, he's gonna blink away from this one, and away from the fight, allowing only to cut the Eclipse! He needs to drop the Eclipse! The EG stop! It buys the space for him! They're ready! Chalice! Perfect stop! Perfect follow-up! Where's the hammer? Drop the hammer! There she is! Now Pasha! He's also trying to walk his way away from this one! Careful. The Agassi Mortal! Randy's back to life again! He's got all the damage! And then Fly comes in for his own stop! Trying to keep the control there! Pasha will take care of that Rubik! But now AM! Will he have enough with the Mana Void? He won't! Ramsey's the Stifling Dagger flew! You will have FY back to safety! AM's cleaning up the base! because the fountain was being attacked. X Nova in the meantime cleaned up by Ramses. The base is in jeopardy, but the Bindbecks are coming without the Tinker, Tiny, and Lich. Maybe they don't keep this going, but it's Ramses.
He feels so much confidence. He jumps in, finds a Rubik. FY deleted. They got the control on the AM and the crit! The damage is enough! The RNG this is there! Elder Titan's dying to the creep wave of all bloody things after it too. So now it's up to OD. The solo one to defend. Pasha is just standing its ground, but the GG is called. The game is on. And Virtus Pro will 2-0 LGD. There's the coach of LGD. Thank you very much. Great.